morning everyone. I hope you're well. I'm gonna leave my hair in this towel. Oh hi princess. Would you like a cuddle? We've had a lovely morning walk haven't we? It went on a little bit longer than we normally would because I did some mindful walking listening to my Calm app and then we met, thank you for the kisses, we met, mmm <laughs> lucky me, although I give you some back. Uh, we met the ladies that we sort of see almost every day don't we? There's a couple of dogs that we walk with, uh, socially distant obviously and it's lovely so we did that this morning and I have to have some breakfast I haven't eaten yet but I thought I would sort of take you along for a chatty typical day in the life I filmed so many day in the life videos but you haven't <laughs> Bonnie girl please don't lick my lips <laughs> you haven't seen a work day for me and I thought even though it might be a bit boring I thought it might be quite interesting to see the sort of things I get up to on a typical day to day so we've quite a lot to get on with today don't we Benji will be home tonight he's been working away the last few nights so we're looking forward to that oh it's time for you to have a little nap I think before I go and have some breakfast the first thing I need to do is publish some Instagram stories that are sponsored by Readly who are a magazine subscription app that I absolutely love so I was really chuffed they wanted to work with me again so I've already pre-filmed the stories and I also send them over sort of edited to show them exactly what they'll look like but I like to use the original and retype out all the information again so that's what I'm going to do so that everything works nicely so we've got three stories that look like this so that's the first thing I need to do and that will probably take me like 10-15 minutes so that is what I'm going to do first a lot of you know by can now, but swipe up and Ridley, get a two months free I love this so much it's only it's seven months a month, month. cancel it anytime. anytime or you can swipe up and get, get two, two months, months for free. free okay so my stories have gone up I don't know if you can see that very well gosh the lighting's terrible there we go so they have all gone up and what I do is I also go on my Brogan Tate home account. I also watch the stories there and just check that the swipe up link works because sometimes, you know, there might be issues. So that one works and then again, swipe up, it all works. Um, and then I also check that the um, tags work for the business as well. Yep, so the tags work for them as well. So that is now all done, which is great. So I can tick that off my to-do list as the first job of the day. Good morning. Good morning. The time is 9.49 a.m. Currently in Bournemouth it's 12 degrees and partly cloudy. Today it'll be mostly cloudy and tomorrow there will be showers. Have a great day. Raining tomorrow. Here's the latest news. Good morning. This is BBC News. That's the latest from BBC News. I'm mm. Alfie Tobit. Finished my breakfast. I've just had a parcel and if it says Brogan Tate on the front, Tate is my middle name, then I know it's a PR parcel and most of my parcels go to my mum's house but I have a select few PRs that I have met in person or I know really well that have my address. Ooh, so I thought I would open it. Look, Sanctuary Spa. So I'm actually doing like a press sort of launch christmas launch for them tomorrow morning so obviously this is ad gifted but not sponsored to talk about this i didn't know this was coming um so yeah gonna have a look at the new launches tomorrow morning on a zoom call but so that's that's tomorrow but they've obviously sent this in advance to show me what is out there so there's a little note that says this is a selection a small selection of the gifts um christmas gifting range for 2020 join them live at 9 a.m Thursday the 8th of October to find out more, which is what I'm gonna do. I'm always so grateful for brands that gift me things and I do often share them on Instagram because I think that's a nice thing to do and um, then I will go over and send an email and say thank you as well. So let me just drop them an email. Just wanted to say a big thank you for sending over a selection. I'm gonna tell her that I particularly love the Beauty Sleep journal before i share on socials i'll just refer back to the note and at the bottom it tells me their username on socials and then the hashtag that they're using for the campaign so oh i just got an automatic out of office um that's fine the girl is not back till tomorrow so we're just going to do a quick story i don't really want the microwave in the background oh and i don't want the washing machine beeping also they've used packaging that is easy to recycle and then i can reuse that box as well 
for gifts. I'll just wrap it up in Christmas paper. Um, but anyway, so let's switch back over to my Brogan Tate account. So I'm still on the home account. And then we're going to get a GIF that says add gifted. Okay, so I've shared, I actually shared a few quotes as well, um, which I do quite regularly on my Instagram stories, but I've shared the Have products. This one's got a little bit of music to it. That's my favorite item in the box. So I thought I'd share that. Lighting in here. I'm now going to get my diary and write out the things I'd like to do today. I'm actually gonna ask Google to put on some nice jazz music. And then I'm gonna to reply to Instagram DMs. I've tidied the office a little bit, so that's good. Emails, I need to do receipts. This is such a boring task. Uh, I need to edit a Primark video and I need to sort out my iMovie because there's something wrong with it on my big computer and I need to sort of delete it and then re-download it. So I'm just going to write out my list so I can tick it off in my diary. So play morning jazz on YouTube. Music station on YouTube music. Lovely. Thank you. Oh, how nice. I've just taken the documents out, but Benji put this on the wall for me. I bought this from Amazon and I've actually like labeled each section. So I've got home stuff, accounting things, any documents that are for the business and then current campaigns I'm working on. I often have to sign briefs, contracts, NDAs, all that sort of stuff. So I'm just gonna put everything back in where it was. So I've got three emails left to reply to. Zoom is just doing an update. I have done all my Insta DMs and I'm now just creating my wallets for my receipts. So I use these clear wallets and then I use my label maker and just write the month and then I file the receipts. The whole process takes me ages to do my accounting, but I have a system now and a system is important. So yes, I get the folders set up and to be honest I normally do month by month but as we're almost at the end of the year I'm going to set up November and December as well so it looks like this I have my in tray with all the receipts for all the expenses I've had for the business recently and then what I have to do is scan each individual receipt through an app on my phone and then I go on the web version of it and I categorize what it is and then I match the receipt with the line on my banking so that the expenses match up um, and sometimes I'll write notes for what it was for. So yeah, I have quite a few receipts actually. I'm a bit behind. I'm very behind actually. Um, and also any sort of banking stuff, uh, like when I have a payment come in from a brand that pays me in a different currency, the bank sort of takes fees for that. So I have to have the paperwork from the bank that they send me matching so I can sort of, yeah, make sure I'm on top of that. So I'm just going to do the other folders now. So done October, do November, December, set them up and then that may be me until the end of the year. But my financial year is until... March. So I'm just doing an email to a brand that has come in who I've worked with before. They love my content and we work really well together. I already buy and use and love their products. So I am basically coming up with some ideas because they want to sort of push some sales around Christmas time. So I've been thinking of what might work well, what you would quite like to see, asking if they can offer any sort of discount for you guys, because that always is nice. So that's what I'm working on. I'm sort of trying to brainstorm how I want the content to look. I can't believe it's 20 to 12, but it is. I need to do this hair. I might end up actually just, um, making it curly because I just don't think I'm gonna have time to blow dry it but I've just finished doing that email to the brand I've worked with before and I've put a few options together for them so I basically offer a few different packages and ideas and we sort of bounce back and forward so they have an idea and I know what they like because I've worked with them before but I've also got a few ideas that I thought they might enjoy so um it's sometimes the brand is absolutely adamant on what they want but other times if I've worked with a brand before they might sort of lean towards what I think will be better so yeah I'm just sort of going back and forth my hair is a bit wild but that's fine because we're just working from home and I will end up probably putting it up in a scrunchie later but anyway I've just gone downstairs let Bonnie out into the garden and I've now got myself a nice cup of tea to be honest I normally drink tea much earlier in the day it's five to twelve and 
I normally have one like nine, ten o'clock with my breakfast, but today just hasn't happened yet. So anyway, I finished my emails, which is great. So the next job I want to do is do a flat lay and I haven't done a flat lay photo for a little while, um, but I am basically promoting Big Potato Games new game called Sketchy Tales and it's a Disney game. So I have a few of the filmed a favourites video for them. Um, so I've got all the stuff still on the bed. So this has got to be done today, tidying up. Um, but I have... Um, <laughs> okay bought me a mickey waffle huh go on then go find it there's loads of sort of elements to the game and have i still got my drawing under here yeah i do and i think it'll be really nice to sort of do some sort of disney flat lay with a pair of mini ears maybe or any i've got loads of disney bits and bobs don't know where to shoot it yet because with flat lays they look quite nice on sort of a plain surface when we first got her i didn't get anything done because i just did this all day <laughs> I'm having to film at basically just this angle because I have a glass writing board on the wall here and it's got loads of personal details on it. But anyway, I have just gone downstairs to take a few photos of Sketchy Tales, the game. I'm not 100% sure on them until I edit them. I don't know whether to have myself in the photo as well. Um, it's very difficult to sort of shoot a game that you're not playing it kind of thing. Um, but I think the box is sort of self-explanatory. So... I put the um, fairy lights on the tree in the background and it looks quite pretty and I was going to do sort of a selection of other Disney things but then it started to look too messy because the game has got so many different elements to it like the scorecard, the character cards, the, the drawing itself, the um, sort of word cards, it doesn't, if you do know on, on about this makes no sense but um, anyway it's a Disney drawing game so there's already quite a lot of pieces to the game if that makes any sense. Anyway. I'm going to sit and edit these now and I use Lightroom or I edit in Instagram but Lightroom is good to sort of make it pop a bit. I don't really use many filters or change it too heavily um, because I like my Instagram to look really natural. So Benj and I are always on the hunt for things that we can go and do, that we could potentially vlog, things that are obviously safe and close to home, stuff we can do with Bonnie, stuff we can do without her, just sort of anything that's going to be really lovely around Christmas time. I really want to go to some like garden centres and we've got a couple of things booked in that we want to do but Benji's just found a really lovely event, he's just seen it um, and sent me the link and it's basically at Swanage Railway and they're doing sort of um a lights christmas lights thing socially distant and i just think it'd be so lovely so we're going to book that sort of the week of christmas um and i've just got to pay for that and book the tickets now so that's what i'm going to do next because that is um something we can go and vlog and i put it in the diary and it's sort of planning in things that we can do so i'm always sort of trying to keep an eye out for stuff like that. Um, we are hoping to go to Blenheim Palace and do their Christmas lights as well, because that would be so beautiful. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna sort this out next. Exciting. So I'm making good progress. I've sent those images to Big Potato Games to see what they think. My emails are now totally clear. So the next thing I wanna do is, ah, I jinxed it. <laughs> oh, that's fine. That's really just saying thank you for publishing this morning. That's all good. Don't worry. So the next thing I want to do is re-download iMovie so I can actually edit again because there's something wrong with my iMovie. I've been editing on my laptop, which is in the bedroom because I've been working from there last night, late last night. I was in bed editing. Um, I need to go and get it in a minute because I'm actually editing a Primark video. Um, and then we've got to do receipts. So that's everything on my list today. And it's one o'clock. So I think I'm gonna pause, go and get some food. And then we will look at how to, actually no, 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 no. We'll delete iMovie and re-download it. And maybe while I'm going to get lunch, it can sort of re-download. Okay, Big Potato have already replied because they're so lovely. And they said, these look fab. I especially love the first image. So thank you, that is great news for me. I've also just been paid. That's come into my PayPal. So I just need to move that money over to my main bank account. And then I will sort of figure out what I want to pay for myself, what I want to put in savings, what I need to put aside for tax. 
So whenever I get paid, I have to sort of do all those questions in my head. Um, right, but I'm still in the middle of downloading iMovie. So I need to go into the app store now. I've had to put a hairband in because my hair is in my face. So now Big Potato have approved my photos. I've put them in a carousel. And then what I do is I'll start a little note on my phone and save the caption that I've written out. And then I'm going to go over to Twitter and write, write a shorter version because Twitter has a character limit. Um, so what I'll do is I'll do it on Instagram first and then I paste uh, the Twitter one. And then as you can see, I need to work on this. So I'll just adapt this. And then once I've got two captions, one for Twitter, one for Instagram, I will send them over as well. And hopefully they'll approve the captions. Um, so that is pretty simple. Um, I'm still trying to work out iMovie. I'm trying to do two things at once here. Okay, we're re-downloading. See this little spinny thing here. Hopefully we can get this back on my computer properly. Look at my hair. Oh my goodness, right. Such a lovely sunny day actually, blue skies. So we'll probably go out in like, I don't know, an hour or two. I like to walk her in the afternoon as well. She did have quite a long walk this morning, so we'll probably only do like 15, 20 minutes. And I took her for a really nice walk yesterday. We went somewhere we've not been before. And I also put her in um, a dog wash station. It was three pound for three minutes. And you press the different buttons to get shampoo, conditioner, water, and you can even dry them as well. It was great. So we did that yesterday. So she's had some lovely walks while she's gone back upstairs. But anyway, time for lunch. My favorite lunch is a bagel fin. And then I have, I think I've got some roast beef left, or I have some chicken, and I normally have lettuce, cucumber, or avo. Whoa. The camera just slipped off the um, shelf I had it balanced on, but anyway. Okay, so inside my bagel, I have a piece of roast beef left, so I'm gonna have that with some lettuce. And I also have cream sodas in. I get these on Amazon and I absolutely love them. I've had quite a lot of water today, so I don't feel so bad having a little bit of fizzy. Let me put another one in the fridge. I'm having issues with my computer. I'm trying to restart it because it's not downloading iMovie. Everything's sort of disappeared on it. I'm moving over to this computer, this laptop, which I have my Primark call editing on. Um, yes, good. Thank God I have a laptop and a computer because this happens more than you think. <laughs> So I thought I'd show you the issue I'm having with my computer. I've just been editing this video. I think I'm pretty much done now. I'm just re-watching it through. So I'm almost at the end. But as you can see, under transitions, which I use quite regularly, I use the fade to black at the end and the cross dissolve at the beginning. And I use the swipe left quite regularly as well. Um, so yeah, these transitions are quite important for the editing process. But iMovie on here is not showing any. It's saying current theme, no theme. Um, under transitions. I don't know where they've gone and obviously deleting it, re-downloading iMovie didn't work. I've just seen my hair in the viewfinder and although it's lovely, naturally curly, it's too hot and annoying around my face so I literally shove it up in a bun every single day. I don't need a hairband. So I've tried to speak to Apple and I can't get through to anyone at the moment. It says that they're experiencing high number of calls so I can't seem to do the chat function either, so I'm not having a lot of luck. Um, so I'm gonna park that for a minute, might have to try again tomorrow. So um, I'm gonna make a thumbnail for this Primark haul and sort of get that scheduled for next week because um, it's finished exporting. So I'm gonna do that next. Call back you scheduled with Apple support. If you're ready to speak to an advisor, press one. Okay. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your time. Have a good rest thank of the day. You. Yeah, keep yourself safe and every success with the vlog. Okay? Oh, thank you so much. Thank Cheers. Bye. Bye. Oh, it took 25 minutes, but the guys fixed it. Um, I was on the right path. We were sort of trying to see what was going on, um, but it ended up being I just needed rebooting. Rebooting. Yeah, a reboot. That always fixes it, doesn't it? Turn it off, turn it on again. Um, so yeah, now I have my transitions back, so that's great. So that's something I can tick off my list. So it's now half past three, and I think we'll go for a little 
little walk around the park if you like i've just had a contract come through for a brand that i've been going back and forth with i've never worked with them before but i've been a customer of theirs for over a year and i know it's been a year because they sent me an email recently saying happy one year anniversary here's a discount um so i'm really excited to work with them but i've just been sort of asking for some changes in the contract and they have very kindly changed them for me so I'm going to get that printed and I can pop it in my current campaigns sort of folder area, get it signed off and sent back to them today. Um, but I will just need to re-read to check that they have rewritten what I want in the contract. And I'll play with you in the park. Maybe, oh, should we take a tennis ball today? I think we'll take the tennis ball because we haven't taken it for about a week. And you do like a tennis ball, don't you? You like me throwing something for you and you bring it back to me, huh? <laughs> All right. All right, let's go do that. Drop it. Bunny drop. Good girl, well done. Ready? Ready? Good girl. <laughs> oh, she's so clever. Come here then. Good girl. <laughs> and, she, and she just rolls on her back and says, please give me a cuddle. Oh, good girl, well done. Good girl. Sit. Wait, wait, wait. Come in. So clever. Oh, yes, you are so clever. We're back from our walk. We are at 11 and a half thousand steps today. And my goal is normally to try and reach 10. So that's good. I'm pretty happy with all the walking we've got in. I will feed Bonnie her dinner in about half an hour, 45 minutes. It's now four o'clock. So I'm gonna spend the next hour trying to crack down and get these contracts, contracts, the receipts sorted. And then I've got a contract to read and potentially sign today. So that is where I'm at. I feel like it's been a really productive, good day so far. It is now half past five and I've just read through the revised contract that I asked the changes on and it's all good now. I'm happy with the terms of the campaign. So I'm really excited about it because like I said, this is a brand that I have bought from and used for a long time, well, just over a year, um, so I'm very excited. So I'm using an app called Tiny Scan or Tiny Scanner. Um, you can actually use your notes on iPhone, I think, but I just like this. And I'm going to scan in the document. So there's three pages to it, so that's page one. I have almost finished reconciling everything. I just have one, two, three, four, five things left which are emails, email receipts. So yes, that is what I'm gonna do next. I'm just gonna rename this document so it doesn't say the date and the time because that's what it's named it as automatically. So let's just rename. And also I did a competition with Big Potato Games and they have sent the prize to the winner and they've just replied to say that it's all sorted and that's done. So we're making really good progress. Please find attached my signed contract. So they've already sent me over a brief because I like to read that before I sign anything. So I know what I'm making, obviously. So tomorrow I'll sort of write down all the ideas that I originally had and have talked about with them. And next time I speak to my coach, I've got an influencer coach that I speak to at the beginning of every month. I will speak to her at the beginning of November. She can help um, sort of look over this campaign with me as well. So we can make some decisions on how, to, where, which direction to take the content. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. I have an event that I want to attend tonight um, about uh business in a pandemic basically um i think it's called hang on let me get what it's called there we go so that's the event with these speakers it's all about practical advice for weathering a recession so it's a free event for non-members but i am actually a member oh she can she did um it's a benefits program for self-employed women in the uk i'll leave a link below actually just in case you are as this is a video all about working, working for myself, um, in case you're interested, I'm not affiliated or sponsored or have anything, any sort of connection with them. Uh, the girl that runs it is super nice. You're such a good girl. Have you had a nice day with me? <laughs> Has it been a nice day, huh? All right, I've got to go and do dinner before this event starts. I've got 30 minutes to do a little bit of dinner. 
and then Benji would take over. Yes. Yes. I missed you. Me too. You missed you. I missed me too. I missed me too. If I was you. Um, dinner is served. I've been working nights for the last couple of weeks, or days and nights. Mm. Um, so my body clock's just completely off. All I've had today are some eggs at 10 o'clock, and that's all I've eaten. You had any lunch? I had eggs at 1 o'clock, nothing before then. We're watching Bake Off. This little one is on my lap. Oh, she's moving. I wiggled my toes. Oh, is that what you were doing? I was just twitching my foot and she... Honey cow. Come on then, come back to you anyway. You're all snuggly down there, huh? My buzzer. No, no. No, no. Bless her. He's so cute. Love you. Anyway, we're just watching the end of Bake Off and then we're going to go to bed. So I just thought I'd leave it here. Uh, thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll be back again with another one very soon.